is actually going to be on how you manage to convert what you have learned to impacting the society. And for you to get that done, your technical skills are very, very important. Again, I'm not going to bore you with what I have here. Uh, you need to know about process simulation, structural modeling, uh, circuit simulation, and modeling, finite element. challenges in our community and environment. As engineers are problem solvers, I want them to identify with the challenges around them and make sure they solve it. I'm impressed with the academic performance of the students today. At least each department I saw the least CGPA was 4.53. We have the best graduating students having a CGPA 4.95. That is a wonderful achievement. So I want to encourage um, students that are still in school undergraduates that they should know what they are doing. Though it is theoretical, but this theoretical learning, they are giving them knowledge of what they can transform when they eventually graduate. So well, I feel overwhelmed with joy and happiness because it's been a long time coming. Five years is no joke. And um, yeah, I'm just excited and yeah, I'm just excited. As a graduate of biomedical engineering, um, what next would be postgraduate studies? I'm looking more at um, research in biomaterials, uh, biocompatibility, uh, materials that are more biocompatible with the body. And then, I mean, from there we we'll figure it out. Yeah, we want to thank God for another milestone achievement for our students. The graduating student of 2024 2025, we are excited to have them join the graduate of uh, uh, membership of Nigerian Society of Engineers. So it is a delight for us to have them join this uh, prestigious society. And uh, it's something that they have been looking forward to, and it's an opportunity for them to have a platform where they will be able to be inducted as professional engineer and this particular achievement today is to create a way for them by which they can also hand a point when they will be assessed as membership of professional body so it will also create a, an opportunity for our students a network opportunity where they can also meet with senior colleagues in the practice of engineering and we are happy to have in our midst today the the, the national president of Nigerian Society of Engineers, uh, Engineer Professor Engineer Margaret Aina Oguntala, the Chairman in Council, Nigerian Society of Engineers. So it is a beautiful day for us having our parents celebrating with our students.